Did you know the world's first successful open-heart surgery was performed in 1893 by a black surgeon named Dr. Daniel Hale Williams in Chicago? At a time with no x-rays, no blood banks, no antibiotics, and barely any anesthesia, Dr. Williams attempted what most doctors believed was impossible. A young man arrived at his hospital with a knife wound straight to the chest. Instead of giving up, Dr. Williams opened the man's chest, located the injury, and repaired the torn pericardium by hand, all without the modern tools surgeons rely on today. The patient survived and went on to live for decades, making this the first documented successful open-heart surgery in medical history. But Dr. Williams didn't stop there. In 1891, he founded Provident Hospital, the first black-owned and interracial hospital in the United States. At a time when black doctors were shut out of training programs and black patients were denied care, Provident became a groundbreaking institution. It trained black nurses, opened doors for future black physicians, and proved what equitable medical care could look like. Dr. Williams' achievements didn't just save lives, they reshaped American medicine. His work pushed surgical boundaries and helped build a system where black medical professionals could finally develop their talents. His legacy is a reminder that brilliance thrives even when society tries to block its path. Follow us for more mind-blowing true stories in black history.